Hey, what's up everyone? It's David here. I've got the Sky Q here again. And today's video, I'm going to show you how to reinstall your apps on your Sky Q. Now, for whatever reason, they disappear after you turn your, your Sky Q box back on after standby, or if you turned it off from the mains, for whatever reason, they're not there. And obviously the way to get them to come back on there is free no methods the first one uh, i'm going to show you first but before i do so if you could click the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i'd appreciate it that would help me out a lot and if you feel free to comment below now let's um going to get into it so Sky has Netflix, YouTube, Paramount Plus, BBC iPlayer, and Disney Plus all on its um, hardware. And sometimes it disappears, but so as you can see, the only one there is Peacock TV. That's the app that seems to not disappear every single time this occurs quite a lot on my sky q box for various reasons it, obviously it occurs on other people's as well i'm not the only one but um yeah so youtube bbc iplayer disney plus paramount plus netflix all disappear and all the various other ones that i have not listed but there are three ways to fix this fault and the first way is to go into the secret sky installer menu typing in 001 select and this menu will pop up scroll down to apps click on refresh and that refresher app list and like i said this is one of many troubleshooting guides so now go back to apps and we'll see if that's fixed it okay in this case it hasn't done that so we've still just got peacock tv second one is put it in standby And turn it back on and we're going to check that again and it's still not there okay so the first method hasn't worked second method hasn't worked and there's the third method we turn it off from the mains that's right so wait 10 seconds and then plug Turn back on the switch, or plug it back in, depending on which way you, you do it. You either pull out the figure of eight, or you turn it off on the wall. And this menu, sorry, this will appear, the startup sequence. And we'll have to wait a minute or two before this obviously reinitializes but i got a good feeling that this time it probably will work i like to mention if this third method doesn't work you have to call in the sky engineer as there might be a fault with the actual box itself I would like to mention making sure that your Sky Q's software is up to date. As of December 2022, it should be at Q210. But if it's below that, then that might be the reason. And so obviously do the forced update. Check back to see if it's got Q210. If it's still not on there, 
then definitely call Sky to get a Sky Engineer out. Okay, the, re the box is ready for back and we'll see and it's there hurrah i fixed it so i got bbc iplayer netflix youtube prime video i think the box just seems to be a bit like there okay so it's done it again so prime video Paramount Plus, Apple TV Plus, Disney Plus, Discovery Plus, and uh, Peacock's there, but it never went away. So they've all been returned back to the, the Sky Q, which is great. And as you can see, that concludes the video. Thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, please, if you like the video, press that thumb up. That would help me out a lot. And uh, see you out there.